Hi, everybody, and welcome to Honey Pop. I know what you're thinking. Why? I say, why not? I also say, let's begin this weird, freaky journey. Okay, yeah, I just barely started that, but we're gonna erase it. We're gonna erase it. That way you can all come with me on this journey of weirdness. Honey Pop. Me? Ah, uh, you're cute. I know, right? It's cute. crazy. <laughs> My name is Kiyu. Nice to meet you. Oh, oh hi, Kiyu. Uh, let's see, you mean like the letter? Clever. It's a weird name. I literally can't remember my name right now. Right. We'll try that again later. Look, dude. Are you gonna be all right? Looks like you're having some trouble holding it together over there. I'm fine. You just, you just, yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> I can see how uncomfortable you are right now from space. Wow. Hmm, wait, you know what? What? This might actually work. It will. Yeah. Yeah! Oh man, this is your lucky day. It's buddy. my it's our it's our Listen, lucky day. <laughs> I gotta go. But we'll meet We're all gonna get day. laid! Trust me. Night! Night night. Where are you going? Where's you going? Bart. Ooh. Bouch. Hey you, rise and shine. We've got work to do. Who the hell are you? I said get up. <laughs> I'm already up. <laughs> I was having the best dream. I'm up. Am I gonna have to pull the covers off? Yet yeah, with your teeth. <laughs> Afraid not. This is totally happening. Don't you recognize this adorable face? <laughs> it's Kiyu from the bar. The pink hair. You had brown hair. Clever disguise, right? I can change my hair any color I want. It's pretty sweet. Do the curtains you match the drapes, baby? I'm a fairy. <laughs> yeah, a love fairy to be exact. Not a masculine fairy. Oh, go yes. <laughs> Funny. But let's leave the sarcasm to me, all right? No. You see, as a love fairy, it's my job to help poor saps like you. I'm not a poor lady. sap. It's just mm, what I do. I don't like to. Oh, brag, I can kind of move but around. You know, I have a very impressive track record. All of my previous clients Large are basically walking big bands now. You though. <clears throat> let's just say you will be my greatest accomplishment yet. Uh, thanks, but no thanks. I'm doing fine on my own. Why do you want to help me? What's in it for you? Uh... Man, you and all the questions. Mm -hmm. Can't a fairy just help a brother out? We need to get started right away. Tell me, how many dates have you been on? Well... With, like, actual girls? Oh my god, it's worse than I thought, isn't it? All right, grab your shit. We're going on a date right now. Ooh. Someone has to show you the ropes. Apparently, they're swearing in this one. All right, anime and swearing. Or not, I don't care. All right, Sunday night, your bedroom, outdoor lounge. Classy. All right, I'll try to make this quick. This is the date grid. These little pieces are called tokens. You earn affection by matching three or more of the circular tokens horizontally or vertically. This For looks familiar. Game, you have to fill the affection meter before you run out of moves. Go ahead, give it a shot. Match those orange ones with the crescent shape in the middle of the grid. See? Easy! Each I made of the four types of affection tokens represents a particular trait. The orange ones represent romance, 
Blue is talent, green is flirtation, and red is sexuality. Pay attention to which trait your date prefers. It'll go a long way. Of course, matching four or five tokens will get you even more affection. I'll show you. Match those four sexuality tokens in the bottom right of the grid, the red ones. Sweet. Okay, what's next? Oh, right. Let me cover the other it's tokens candy crush. real quick. The pink kind of. hearts are passion tokens. Matching those will raise your date's passion level. The higher her passion level is, the more affection you'll earn. The gold bells are joy tokens. You'll get an extra move by matching those. Very Ooh. useful. The broken heart tokens are bad news. Seriously, avoid matching those as best you can. Finally, the teardrops are sentiment tokens. Matching those gives you, well, sentiment. You need sentiment in order to use date gifts. And seeing as how you don't have any date gifts... Date gifts, I'm is that like roofies? <laughs> That's not funny. I'll hook you up with one of mine. It's on the house. Ooh. Like I said, you'll need sentiment to use it. So go ahead and match those three sentiment tokens in the leftmost column, the teardrops. What? Oh. Okay, now go ahead and give that date gift to me. Hey, look at me! I like the boobs! Kizzy kizzy. Yay! Cool, huh? There are like a ton of different date gifts that you can get too. They each have a unique effect on the date and can be extremely useful in combination. Kids, oh. folks. <laughs> and thanks to a it's not that easy. Magic, you'll never actually lose them. Fairy magic. So can use them on <laughs> the next too. That's what they have at the bars in Chicago. Alright, alright, I've gone on long enough. I'll let you finish up the date Shut so you up. can get the hang of it. Oh, and don't worry. I won't let you fail this one. I'm not that mean. I guess I don't really need sediment. Sentiment, not sediment. Give me some sedimentary rocks. Ooh. Aww. What? <sighs> me not smart enough. Extra move! <laughs> All over ya. <laughs> That's so filthy. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> this case perverted. All we're missing is the ten year olds and the octopus tentacles. Oh, Ooh, excuse me. I'm tired. <laughs> Muscle tough. Put your affection all over me. Weirdo. All over me. <laughs> no. I wanna kiss you all over. All over and again. I wanna kiss you all over. Till the night closes in. Yeah. <laughs> Do you folks see anything? I see a kitty. Oh, hell's bells. Help me. Oh, I must be blind. 
Love you long time. <laughs> I totally blew that one out of the water. What? Really? Is by <laughs> nice. See, I knew you had it in you. Had something in you. <laughs> These games are filthy. I love it. <laughs> oh shit! It's morning already. We are way behind schedule. Okay, check it out. I have one last thing to give you, and this is important. Introducing the latest in Love Fairy technology, the Honey Bee 4.0. The Honey Bee is an essential lifeline for any player on the go. It automatically registers the info of new Creeper upgrade and can even Engage. check their location. You can organize your inventory, buy new gifts, upgrade your traits. It's awesome. We don't have time to go over every feature, but you're a big boy. You can figure it out. I to big access boy. the Honey Bee, all you have to do is right click at pretty much any time. Or if you're weird, you can use that button at the top of the screen. And go ahead, break that bad boy open. Oh. Why do I have these? Okay, great. I think that's it for now. Let's get out there and talk to some broads. <laughs> they don't like that. I said, let's go talk to some broads. Video games. What's that? I didn't hear you. Did you say, hell yeah? What's that? I didn't hear you. Did you say, hell yeah? I said... Aww. That's what I like to hear. Now if you want to meet a hot chick, you gotta go where the hot chicks are. I've done some scouting and I have a few ideas of where to start. It depends what type of girls you're into. We can check out the university, the mall, the gym, the park, or the nearby cafe. What'll it be? Where should we go first? Hmm? No answer. Let's go to the mall. Good choice, Ricky. Couldn't have picked it better myself. All right, ready? Get your game. Wow. On. Let's do this. Monday, the first morning, shopping mall. <laughs> what the fuck? Of course you screwed it up again. That's exactly what you asked for. Are you joking? Bitch, do I look like I'm joking? How am I supposed to roll around like this? You're fucking loco. This is how I always cut your nasty ass hair. Nasty ass hair? Ugh, don't even. Look who's talking, skank. No, bitch. My hair isn't dried out and reeking of smoke, okay? Whatever, ho. Why don't you go get knocked up again? You need to turn around and walk away. What's wrong? Did I hurt your whore feelings? Turn around and walk away. This is a Grab proper me. Christmas conversation, Grandma. Fucking whore ass bitch needs to learn. Wow. Ooh, she's a little feisty one, huh? Oh yeah, don't worry. They can't see or hear me. I'm just a figment of your imagination. Plot twist! <laughs> nah, I'm crazy real. I just hid myself from everyone so I can give you advice on the sideline. <laughs> this is what we refer to as a mega bitch. Confidence <laughs> is key here. 
She has to know like my wife when she wakes up in the morning. Going to phase you. So whatever you do, <laughs> just stay cool. Cool, got it. Uh, could you move, please? You're kind of in my way. Piss off, skank. even doing at the mall anyway besides creeping on girls well you know what they say about the high school girls i get older they stay the same age oh just creep <laughs> creepy <laughs> is that so well you're going to have to do a lot better than that Sorry, but you did put in effort, I guess. And you are kind of cute. I'll tell you what, if you're lucky, maybe we can go get high sometime. You down? <laughs> Air day. Nice. Name's Audrey. Get at me if you want to make things crazy. Now, if you don't mind, could you get the fuck out of my way? No way. You did it! Well, with my help, of course. I gotta admit, I did not expect you to pull that off. Beginner's luck. Don't let it go to your head. By the way, that other Witch chick that was head. here just a second ago? Since she was in range, the honeybee started tracking her location, too. So after you're done here with this girl, you can go catch up with her, too. Just bust out the honeybee and check out the girl finder screen. I'm pumped. You pumped? Yeah, you Girl fighting your screen. I'll oh. around if you need me. <laughs> what am I saying? Of course you need me. Oh boy. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Oh my god! Fine! Wow. Okay, I'm here. So now what? <laughs> Not a good time to travel. Bye! Okay. Flirtation. Narcotics. <laughs> good God. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. And then there's the phone in the background. I do not think I'll be able to do this. Okay. The hell is that thing?
the phone keeps ringing. There it stopped. Nine moves left, huh? Ooh, it's gonna be a toughie. I want to be a toughie toughie. gonna happen not this time folks she is a heartbreaker Not gonna be able to do it. Oh wait, extra turn. Yeah. Oh, that's harsh, baby. <laughs> oh. So here's a question. What's your biggest turn off, huh? my deal. Since you're here, you can answer this for me. What kind of people you just fucking hate to even look at? Ugh, I know! Even my friends can be so plastic sometimes. Okay, I want to know something. So, what kind of shit are you on? And go get me something to eat. I don't get some food. Like right now, I'm gonna punch somebody in the dick.
smoke weed every day. All right. Bye bye. What a goofy bitch. Yo, I didn't expect to see you here today, Tiffany. Yeah, my English lit class was canceled. I'm trying to make good use of the time. Hey, listen. Thanks so much for watching Philip the other day. I know it was last minute. No, don't even mention it. I'd love to hang out with Billy. I'm guessing I'm Philip's her kid. Did he give you any trouble? Nope, like an angel. An angel? Are you sure you were watching the right kid? <laughs> you. <laughs> I know I still owe you two, so don't worry. I should be getting my paycheck tomorrow. I won't hear of it. I was more than happy to help out. Nonsense. I'm not taking no for an answer. Too late. <laughs> Too late. For Calch. Hey, get back. Here. This isn't over. No, oh, it's over. Man, will you get a load of these two? I'd kill to have tits like that. Wow. This chick is clearly out of your league, but there may be hope. She's probably looking for a decent guy because of that baby mama drama. So just try not to be an ass for like five minutes. Oh, she's looking over this way. Showtime. Hey, are you finished with that machine? I have one set left to jam out. Yep, just finished. It's all yours. Go ahead. You look like you need it more than me. <laughs> Wrong answer. I was just trying to look cool. No, it's all yours. Awesome. Thanks so much. You're welcome. <laughs> Thanks, I try. You must be new here. I don't think we've met before, right? I like to think I know all the regulars here on a first name basis. You could say I'm a little obsessed with this place, I guess. <laughs> My name's Kiana. Will I be seeing you here more often? Great, I'm counting on it. Oh, dude, you know what? You have to try one of the yoga classes they do here. The instructor is awesome. I think you'd dig it. If you like being in a room with a bunch of sweaty girls, that is. <laughs> I will just have to suffer. Let me ask 
you something. Do you get up early in the morning or stay up really late at night? That sounds just like me. I get up and head right to the gym. What was I going to ask you again? Oh, right. Do you think of yourself as a person who takes responsibility for his actions? That's really, really good to hear. Unfortunately, I haven't met many people like that. Did you want to say something? That's okay. My last name is Del Rio. Oh boy. I'm starving over here. Let's go eat, like, anything. Like, everything. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh buddy. Creepy. All right. I cannot afford. Oh. It feels like I haven't eaten anything in like a hundred and fifty years. It's tempting, but I think I'm gonna pass. Aw. <laughs> no, that's bad. That's bad, 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 bad. Okay, have a super awesome day. Super awesome. Ooh. Oh, Miss Yumi, I'm glad I ran into you. Have you had a chance to grade our exams yet? Uh, remind me what that was on again? What kind of a teacher is that? Of whatever you call it. And why didn't yeah, I have yeah. teachers like I that? Think those are on oh, I just, I just Somewhere. don't know. Oh, okay. Do you know when you might be able to get them back to us? Later. Oops. You think? I hope so. I don't know, I was having trouble with some of the material. Do you know what we're going over next week? I'd like to try and get a head start this time. Next week? I don't know yet. Actually, I have a pounding headache right now. Can we do this later, please? Yeah, okay. Sorry to bother you, Miss Yumi. No, it's fine. I'll talk to you later. Whoa, is this chick serious? That schoolgirl uniform is a little on the nose, don't you think? She's cute, though. Blonde, too, so... Uh... Bonus point! This is your classic girl-next-door situation. She's nice, so don't say anything to scare her off. But don't be afraid to take a chance. I sure do. I know this place inside and out. You go past the building here and take a left at the fountain. You can't miss it. I haven't seen you around here before. Good God. Are you starting this semester? I wonder how many people just sat around thinking this shit up for this game. Uh... Of course. This place is awesome. My professors are the best. No, don't worry about it. I'm all done with classes for now. My name is Tiffany, by the way. It's nice to meet you. Hi, Tiffany. You seem like a cool guy. Hopefully, I'll see you around campus. Question time. Would you date an unattractive girl if you really liked her as a person? Hmm. You think so? Whoops. Well, I haven't really decided on a major yet, so I'm just getting my core classes out of the way. Something on your mind? Pink all day. Not hot pink. I prefer like a light milky pink. 
I am so hungry right now. She's hungry. Candy. Well, it just so happens. I'm so glad I know. I have a sweet tooth. Oh god, I love these! You know, I've kind of been wondering. If you had to pick one, what do you think your biggest weakness is? Oh, really? I think I'm gonna pass out if I don't get something to eat. Really? Oh. I don't have any of that money. Shit, is it that time already? Oops. Uh, bye. <laughs> Goofy broad. Donwood Park. Uh, good morning, Aiko. Oh, hey, Belly. What's wrong? Seems like something's bothering you. Yeah. Life. <laughs> How are classes going? Uh, I don't want to talk about that. Mm, well, I think I have just the thing. I'm headed to the beach to work in a few poses. You should join me. Nothing like a little exercise to melt that stress away. Uh, not today. I'm just not feeling it. Will I at least be seeing you this weekend at the studio? I'll be there. I don't think I have anything else going on for once. Great. Can't wait. See you there. Dude, bro, Asian chicks don't even get me started. I have, like, the worst case of yellow fever ever. <laughs> ever. Like yellow, yellow fever? Plague. This is a tough approach. She's kind of in a shitty mood, so say something stupid to try and cheer her up. It doesn't matter what. The stupider, the better. Could you please be more racist? <laughs> well, mission accomplished. Good work. I'm just trying to relax. Enjoy a little downtime between classes. I teach up at UOG. You know the place? It's like the only university in the city for some reason. a physics professor. Let's just leave it at that. <laughs> I'm glad you came over here. I needed a good laugh. The kids call me Miss Yumi, but you can call me Aiko. Oh, Aiko. Let me ask you something. What do you usually do when you can't think of anything else to do? <laughs> oh my god, I hope you're not serious. Mm -hmm. That's how you know you've got nothing to talk about. <laughs> uh, I like green. I've got a question for you. What's your ideal perfect vacation like? Right, okay. There we are. Favorite drink is sake. Boring. I'm pretty fucking irritable when I'm hungry. Wow. Okay, this is a lot to take in. I'm going to leave this here. Let me know in the comments. I, I think I'm going to come back to this one again because I thought it was going to be really stupid. And it is stupid, but it looks pretty damn funny. At least that's me, though. <laughs> Freaking anime. Anyhow, I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.